Hello everyone, welcome to Simple Trading Style channel and today we are going to talk about daily stock market review and we will use easiest and simple trading strategy that works. And we will figure out is it bearish trend or what's going on with the stock market. Please subscribe for YouTube channel and click like button to support the channel. Thank you so much. Let's move to trading view. Today, if you want to learn more about trading view, just go to the, to the description and uh, there, there is the link to my trading view setup training. Or, and there is also there are also multiple links to all my trainings. Okay, let's let me briefly mention about my setup indicators. I'm using only one MACD indicator and script, uh, buy and sell script, and also I'm using moving averages, moving averages. Let me tell you, white it's a May two hundred. Yellow it's a May 20, red it's a May 10, and green it's a May 10, a, a May 5. Buy and sell script. Red uh, on the background, a red color it's a bearish, green color it's a bullish. Okay, MACD, MACD, green line it's a bullish trend, and white line it's a signal line. When the green line change color to bearish, to, to red, it's a bearish divergence, it's a bearish trend. When red, red color change to green, it's a bullish bullish crossover, it's a bullish trend. From green to red, it's a bearish trend, bearish crossover. From red to green, it's a bullish crossover. Okay, uh, histogram, red it's a bearish, green it's a bullish, and zero line it's a yellow line. Zero line it's a yellow line. Okay, let's start it. Let's start a daily spy. Daily spy. Uh, still red line. Still red line. Still a red bar. Far from a May 20. Still bearish trend. Still bearish trend daily. Four hours. Four hours. MACD wants to kind of change direction. It has bearish di bullish divergence. Look at it. In four hours it has bullish divergence. It's a downtrend price, but on MACD, let me, ah, I deleted, okay. On the MACD we have bullish divergence, right? Bullish divergence on MACD histogram. Bullish divergence, it wants to go bullish. And the May 5 was trying to do bullish crossover. MACD is ready to do bullish crossover also. Let's check one hour. On hour, it's a bearish trend, right? Bearish trend. Uh, on, the, on the histogram, it's a bullish divergence. On the MACD, it's also bullish divergence, right? MACD is still bullish. MACD bullish, right? Bullish divergence wants to go bullish. Market wants to go bullish on one hour spy. Market wants to go bullish. Okay, let's move to Q's. Q's daily. Q's daily still bearish, right? MACD bearish, did bearish crossover in the bearish uh, territory. Red line bearish. MACD, yeah, the bullish only one thing that the last bar below all, all moving averages, the only bullish positive thing. It's a, it's a last bar far from 820. Usually it always wants to connect to MA20 when it's far. Still bearish trend. Bearish trend on MACD. On the script it's still sell, sell no buy signal yet. Four hours. Four hours for Qs. Four hours for Qs still sell signal. Still bearish mode with bullish divergence on histogram. Still bullish divergence on histogram, right? We have price action downtrend. On the histogram it's uptrend. Histogram it's uptrend, it's a bullish divergence. Let's check one hour. One hour, yeah, it's the same, right? One hour it's a Bullish, still bullish divergence on the histogram and bullish 
divergence here on the, on the MACD line. Bullish divergences, multiple bullish divergences. And we received what? We received buy signal on script. One hour buy signal. And it's far, it was far from May 20, right? It always wants to connect to May 20. Let's move to Dow. Dow daily. Dow daily. Dow daily. Dow daily. MACD still red. Did bearish crossover over uh, zero line. Bearish trend. Still bearish. Last bar touched. Not last bar. Several bars. For last one, two, three, four, five days. It touched MA200 and kind of bounced from it. Uh, it wants to connect to May 20. It's far from May 20. Bearish trend on MACD. Bearish trend on MACD. Okay, let's check four hours. Four hours? Wow, four hours different. Four hours we already received bullish crossover. It wants to go bullish on four hours. Four hours it wants to go bullish with bearish divergences, right? Market kind of flat. On the histogram we have bullish uptrend on the, even on the MACD line uptrend bullish divergence with bullish signal let's check one hour one hour it was bullish and it did bearish crossover and uh, it's kind of a yeah, flat downtrend on the price action buy signal we receive on the script and bullish divergences multiple bullish divergences on one hour Multiple bullish divergences in one hour. Bullish trend. Bullish trend in one hour. Let's move to IWM, Russell 2000. Russell 2000 daily. Bearish trend on MACD, still red line. Uh, mixed mode, it was buy signal, red bar. Red bar is kind of bull. Bullish hammer. It's a bullish hammer. You'll see. Still bearish trend. Bearish trend on MA moving averages and in the MACD. The only positive the last bar far from 820. It wants to connect to 820. Four hours. Four hours. Different story. Last bar from, from, from 820. Green line. Green light. On the MACD, it wants to go bullish. It's the same, same divergence, right? The price, it's downtrend. On on, the, uh, on on histogram, it's uptrend. Bullish divergence, May twenty, bearish crossover. It's a bearish trend on the May twenty. On four hours, let's check one hour. One hour, it was bullish. It was bullish. Yeah, the histogram it's still yeah, bullish divergence. Yeah, it has it was bullish and changed direction to bearish. Still has bullish divergence on the MACD. It's still bullish, still bullish, and buy signal on the script bullish signal bullish trend. That's what we have. Let's let's do Dow. Let's do summary. Summary: All indexes on daily they still bearish. No changes, bearish. They're building some bullish divergences, small on the histogram, but on the MACD they still bearish. They still bearish. For some reason, script already turned to, to buy signal. On four hours, yeah, on four hours they want to go bullish. They want to go bullish. Um, MACD did bullish crossover. MA5 did bullish crossover. It came back and it, 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 it still they still have strong support at MA200 and bullish divergences on the, on the histogram and MACD changed color to green but you see it was here also to green but it it was not powerful but MA200 it's, it's a strong support we'll see we'll see if it works if it can work one hour Let's see one hour. One hour. Uh, it's different. It's a buy signal and the 
Bullish divergence still bearish on the MACD. On the, on the, yeah, on all indicators still bearish, but script has buy signal. Buy signal and bullish divergences on all indicators on one hour. That's what we have. They are similar for all indexes. On one hour, they all bullish. And uh, on four hours, they kind of mix with bullish divergences. And daily, they are bearish. They are bearish daily. That's all. Yeah, let's move to my disclaimer. I'm not a financial advisor. This video for educational and informational purposes. Please read it. Thank you for watching simple trading style video and I do publish updates for stock market, for ETFs, for cryptos. Please subscribe for all my channels and, and, and the click like button for YouTube channel to support the community. Thank you so much and good luck by now.